Well, it's Fairytown Studios, I'm making a Les Paul style guitar, but this is made out of a slab of Sapili. Normally, you'd probably have a slab of mahogany, exactly the same size, and you'd put maybe a 15mm maple cap on it, so a bit of maple, cut down the middle, split each way so it looks nice. I'm not doing that because I have a bit of maple, and that's just not what I'm doing. Um, I think between the middle of uh, a Les Paul and the edge, there's about 12mm of carving, so from the high point to the low point, it's about 12mm. I'm not going to cut away 12mm of this guitar. If I cut away 12mm, it'll be down here, it'll be really thin on the edge. That doesn't look too bad, actually. Maybe I will do that much carving. Huh. Okay, plan's changed. I'm going I'm to cut away about 12mm. <laughs> Why the hell not? But I would like to go to about 5 or 7mm on the front edge, just because of the neck angle. I don't want... It, the, the neck's only angled back from the start of this pocket to the end, about 5mm, and if I go... 10 mil you'll see the binding go to the black neck i think it'll look cooler if you just see binding because this body's going to be black if you see that white line i think it'll look better so i've got to find a way of going from 12 mil to about 5 mil here that'll be fine um what i used to shape the body i can only apologize for but you know if you want to do it properly don't do it this way I'm going to use a circular saw. Right, now to shape the body with a circular saw. I set the depth to about 9mm. That's going to do the bulk of it, and then I'll set it to a shallower depth and do a bit further in. And then just feather between them with um, a random orbital sander. One of these. So here's my plan for the uh, carving. Have a bit of a line along here. Um, this bit in the middle is what I'm not going to touch and shape away from. Just makes life easier. Um, cut away to about 12 degrees through most of the edge. We go to about five here maybe. I might keep it at 12, sorry 12 degrees, 12 mil here. I might go to 12 mil there, but end up at about between five and seven around where the neck joins and sort of have it come in here as you can see by those lines. Pfft. Don't really have anything else to tell you. And you feel like a memory as you lay by my side. Then you went to your family. So it's been a guitar making ever, but it looks okay. I mean, it looks like it's been butchered, obviously, but that's, you know, I find it really quick and easy to take as much off as possible. So on the random orbital sander, I'm gonna put some 40 mil grit and then just go around the edge. You know, it's not quite at the line in some places, so I'm gonna go around it and uh, smooth it out, and then go to something like 120 grit and then leave it at that for the time being, I think. I mean, this bit here needs, quite a lot more off but we can sort that out. This is how it looks, probably about 20 minutes of sanding, just with grit 40, which is quite extreme. I'll go over it with a grit 60 when I know what's going on. Um, next up, I suppose is, I don't know really, I, could, I suppose I could fit the neck and start getting these to the right depths. Um, yeah, I think it looks quite good. Decision, it took about <laughs> half an hour to shape. 
it looks fantastic. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, leave a load of notes. Let me know how you would do it. Um, and let me know what you think so far. And I'll do a close up on this so you can check it out.